usual faces to any supporters of these two players. Obviously stood up in the background. One hundred and forty. Marcel. Marcel obviously played last weekend, didn't he, in the uh, in the SDA event, getting to the final there. One hundred. Not the SDA event, the WDF event, you mean? Ah. In the Swiss Open and the Helvetia Open, Marcel Wolpen losing to Liam Mendel Lawrence, uh, five three, yeah. One hundred and forty. First one eighty, or is that a one forty? It's another one forty. Seen quite a few of those today from the down, but very few 180s today, I would say. Yeah, it's been a bit, a bit of a dry day on the 180s, hasn't it? Just as we say, that's like step about. Wetting that up, step 140. A great start here from both players. Marcel Walken, obviously sponsored by Loxley, uh, one of the top names in darts. Is that a new sponsorship, James? Is that a fairly recent sponsorship? I don't remember him wearing the, the Loxley logo during last season. I think he's, he has been wearing the Loxley logo for a while now. Um, I 45. I know it's a new look shirt, isn't it? I mean, I know he's been sponsored by Loxley for a while, but I don't know if it's a new, new spot on the shirt. Maybe he's got a new shirt ready for the World Cup. He'll obviously be wearing yeah. the Swiss Darts Corporation logo at the World Cup to... Uh, 91. To the uh, biggest darts corporation in Switzerland. We'll certainly both have to have new shirts printed, won't they? With uh, obviously matching shirts with their names on the back. Could we get our first big fit? 60. Stefan, you require 170. Well, if one man's going to do it, it's probably going to be this man, Stefan Belmont. Oh, oh no, he decides to rust spray instead. Boom. Marcel Wolpen will probably. 85. Well. Marcel, yeah, you so require 116. It's now in the balance. Will he stay on 20s or will he go 16s? I think he will stay on 20s because he's a big double 18 fan. Can he find it? Game shot in the first and leg. Marcel Walpen. Second leg is Stefan to throw first. Booyah. Game on. 15 dart hold there from Marcel Walpen. We said they're the signature Walpen shots, didn't we? We've said this a lot about Marcel Walpen. That's when you know he's playing well when those, those little pop shots come off. 96. Great to see both Swiss players playing well at the tournament this week. It's a shame they both can't progress all the way and get a little bit more match practice but they could tomorrow remember of course Stefan Belmont playing a lot of darts so he's playing SDC Tour Event 1 and 2 today and tomorrow 43 on Wednesday and Tuesday we'll be playing Players Championships 13 and 14 and then have a day off on Wednesday and then on Thursday and Friday yeah. and hopefully Saturday and Sunday playing in the World Cup and lifting that World 44. Cup trophy, which we know is coming home to Switzerland Seven days of darts in eight days, potentially, then. Indeed. Just the very highest quality for Stefan Belmont. Can Speaking of high quality... 180. Opens the 180 account. Beautiful darts. Great darts from Marcel Wolpen there. Puts a bit of pressure on Belly here. Marcel Wolpen, for those of you who haven't watched, 85. has yet to beat Stefan Belmont on the SDC. The only man to do so, Jochen Graudens, Graudens. in a last leg decider. Need we say any more? Bull 12 bull. Oh, Marcel Walpen back to back. 174. Oh, He's coming to form at just the right time with the World Cup around the corner. As much as Belmont will love to see these great darts next week, he doesn't want to see them right now. 180. Wise kind. Two 180s in Marcel the leg. Marcel, you require what 104. Piece. Beautiful 180 from Belmont there. Can we have another ton plus from Marcel? Oh, we can if double 12 gets hit here. Oh, 80. Right Stefan, you require 96. Groudon's in the background there, looking on. Of course, he's been knocked out already today. So, Belmont. Will he go double double? He might need to go there? double double, yeah, that looks obscured. Ooh, okay, stays, but. He's a man that does like to stay on that 16 segment. Uh, on the 56. Marcel, you require 24. So, Marcel Walpen for a 13 dart break. Really important darts here. Does not want to let this game shot in the second Does leg. Marcel Valpen. Two nil up. Third leg is Marcel to throw first. Race. Game Apparently on. Averaging 104 here, Marcel Walpen. Any signs of panic on the Belmont face there? Do you sense, James? No, not at the moment. I think he knows his ability. Uh, I think the only thing that will be panicking him a little bit is just his darts haven't been at the top level all day, really. 140. He's been. I wouldn't want to say living in single five, but he's certainly been 
frequenting single five, hasn't he? A bit more regularly than than you usually see from Stefan Belmont on the uh, on the STC. Yeah, he is back. One other than the other team he's been living in there. Treble twenty. We've seen a lot of. Uh, full uh, three, triple squat. Ah, oh, oh, I can't get my words out. Three <laughs> travel visits, James. Three travel visits. That is exactly what I was trying to say. Marcel, one hundred and twenty-one, four one eighties. I think between them yeah. so far, two legs in. It's incredible, and we are on a nine dart finish. It's not going to go, but we can all dream. We can dare to dream. Fifty-eight. These two certainly do bring the best out of each other, don't they? Every time these two gents have played, it's it's been a magnificent game. I mean. The game of the tournament that I referred to earlier in the uh, in the the, t- the tour finals at the third last month. One hundred. Titled the greatest game in Swiss starting history between these two gentlemen. If it sta- stays at this quality for the remaining, however many legs we've got, then it could be this game is the greatest game in Swiss starting history. It's incredible stuff so far. Can we get another? One hundred and seventy-one. Yes, Must say, require one hundred and forty. Five three treble visits in three legs. It's a very 50-50 leg, you know. Marcel Walpen. 34. Okay. Stefan, you require 92. Not once. Score of 34. I think you will go to situation. travel 20 here. Yeah, he does. For double 16. Two in hand. On his favourite double eight. Favourite double eight. One in hand. 76. Ooh, Marcel, you okay. require 106. Marcel Walpen takes out this 106. A couple of deep breaths in the background there. They, maybe they're a little bit panicked for Stefan Belmont. I don't think he'll want to see that. Turn around and sees his, you know, family and friends looking a bit exasperated. Maybe looking even more exasperated. Marcel Walton finds the 106, but he doesn't. He that, won't. That dart of treble 18 was quite far away there. 92. That one wasn't. That one wasn't, but it's definitely double requires seven, 16. Double 8 for Belly here. Game Five short in the third eight. leg. Brings Stefan Belmont. One now. 13 darts Both legs. Stefan to throw first. Both players Game averaging on. over 100. Three legs into this one. Really cracking darts so far. And tell you who else is throwing cracking darts. Thierry Asparagus, 75 average. Currently 2-0 up on Barry Nelson. Uh, Luis Camacho averaging 88. 1-0 up on Christoph Schumann. And Benjamin Bergen 81. burgling his way into potentially a semi-final if he can beat Ant Schud. 1-0 up. I'm all out of vegetable-related puns. You'll be pleased to hear, James. But Thierry might be marching on. 100. Marching on is Marcel Walpen. Hitting a lot of tons, a lot of ton 40s. The standard of darts here is really quite incredible. I mean, this would stand out as one of the best games of all time if it was on the 99. It's a very high quality game so far. Between two very high quality players. 45. Quick word about Marcel Walton's debut on the Euro Tour, James. We obviously both watched that game against uh, Keegan Brown. What, what were your thoughts on that game? What, what did you make of Marcel Walton's showing his outing on the Euro 60. Tour? 60. There's clearly a lot of nerves on that day. I mean, I think we said it. it. You could tell within the first three darts, he started to throw a hell of a lot quicker than he normally does. And I don't know why that was. It was just the nerves. Um, but if you look at him now, he just looks so much. One hundred and forty. So much. He's, he's like a machine, isn't he? In the SDC, he's so, you know, methodical and mechanical, and and just laser tight on that treble twenty. As we're we about to see another one eighty. One hundred and eighty. for Belmont. Three one eighties for Belmont. One one seven one. One one seven four for Walpen, and two one eighties for Walpen. It's incredible stuff so far, really. What more do you guys want? A nine dart finish and a big fish. We'll have those as well. Two Seventy-five. Stephen good last dart of ball there for, for Walpen, but not quite enough to leave a, a nice finish, I would say. Okay. Belmont just wanting to secure a dart, which he does at tops. 61. Fine tops. Must really require 141. Something we did see in SDC Tour Event 1 last year, he took out a 1 for 1. Can he do it again here? He can with treble 15 and double 18, or treble 19 and double 12. Game shot oh, in the fourth leg. Goodness. Marcel Walpen. <laughs> big booyah. Fifth leg is Marcel to go first. Big booyah. <laughs> Stefan Belmont shut his eyes. He was not impressed with that. That's a wry smile on Belmont's face. He's in trouble Game now. 3 1 down. Broken twice. 
Wow, yeah. wow, Walpen. Seriously impressive. Unbelievable darts from Marcel. Just just my last word on, on Marcel Walpen on the Yuri Tour, James. It's finishes like that. 60. I just come to think about, when I see Marcel Walpen play, they're the finishes that I associate with him and the quality that he has. And it's such a shame that, I guess, on the Yuri Tour, he, he just didn't bring any of that, that magic, any of that spark. 180 for Stefan Belmont here. 180 for Stefan Belmont. This is a joke. Seven 180s between the two players. Marcel will put straight back in that treble 20. Talk of spark. This game's on fire. 140. It's absolutely impeccable. Oh, I've, I've lost superlative to describe how good this game is. Can we see a nine dart finish, Belmont? Oh, no, we could. And that's the only thing that would top it. But he's back into the treble. Can he get a 140? 100. I say just a ton, but it is just a ton. Yeah. Can, can Wolfen capitalise here? No, he can't. So Belmont's going to have six from 97. Two, Amazing switch again from Wolfen. Staring down the barrel of a treblous visit on his own throw. Clutch treble 19. To keep his nose just ahead maybe in this 50-50 this looking leg. 57. 57 yeah. score. Leaves 1-6-4. So you'd really think that, that Walpen probably has six from 204, but a bit of spray there. He's going to have to switch to leave a finish. 24. Oh, and leave wow. It's definitely require so 164. Need to go for this now. We were singing his praises a second ago, Walpen. I won't find that so clever. Needs a treble here, really. Does not want to leave a ton. Oh, I almost think here should have gone 19 second dart so he could go for 45. The you see the look on Belmont's face. You see the look on the, the crowd's face as well. They're not impressed. There's certainly some, some negative vibes amongst the Belmont crowd here, amongst the, the Belmont contingent. 85. Should definitely nervous. require 119. The momentum is all with Marcel Walton here. Treble 20 in tops would turn the tide. And he can't get it. Now, 95 is not an easy finish. 42. Ooh. Massa, you require 95. The big 20. Just minimum requirement there to leave yourself a two data. Goes trouble 19. Will he go double yeah, 19? Go this, James. Yeah. Game short oh, in the fifth leg. Marcel Walpen. Sixth yeah, leg is Stefan Truffaut for game up against here. Incredible finishing. Both players just dropping below that 100 average. But he's checked 116, 141, and adds that collection of 95. Four winning legs. Marcel Walpen has been putting on a treat. 140. And yeah, and let's not forget, he also wired a 104 check out as well. So, almost been combinations in every single winning leg that he's had. This has been the best darts I've ever seen from Marcel Walpen. It's really something special. His first dart has been absolutely perfect today, hasn't it? Something we, we often comment about. Is it low? You know, the, the Belmont first dart, you know, we sometimes criticise as well being a touch low, but both players... Absolutely in the mood. 100. Obviously, Be uh, Stefan Belmont is getting another invite back to the Modus Lively. Will we see Marcel Walpen get his first invite to the Modus Lively? I think he deserves it. Darts like this and, you know, 57. He's capable of, of tearing through that, that Modus field. Yeah, I think that the darts have only improved since the STC has started. Can we get another 180, Belmont? Can we get another 180? Make it 180. Eight. Make it eight 180s for the game. Ten, tre three treble visits. Incredible stuff. And we're not done there. We're not done there, folks. Make it. Would you like another 140? Oh, Stefan, you 140. require 81. Would have been we're on getting greedy. for 180 of the game. We're getting greedy. So, Stephen Belmont, double 16. For a 12 dart. Game short in the sixth leg. Stefan Belmont. Leg. And a jug administered to Marcel Seven leg is Marcel to four first. Okay, yeah. Game Show on. respect there. He would have had to hit a nine darter if he was going to break throw there and win that leg. So, he'll have to wait for this one. Just averaging the 102 and losing 4-2, James. Yeah, just 102 <laughs> average. It's, it's pathetic, really. Imagine it? not 85. winning a game. Averaging 102. And it's quite ironic that they're going to have to... <laughs> his next opponent, if he's to get through, is going to be averaging probably around 70. So it's going to be 30-point dip in the average if Marcel Walpen is to win his next game as well. 45. Is this the sign of a defeated Belmont? The energy... Well... He just survives the rolling camp Walpen here. 
60 and Belmont's still in it here. 60. It 60. And he's still very much alive here. Change of camera, you can see here everyone that's watching in the background. Some people on their phone probably checking yeah. it, sharing it on I mean, social media. You, if you're watching this game, you need to be glued to the board, not on your 59. phone. 59. This is, this is world-class Spears. Jacob Dalman in the background recording for the new Drive to Survive series that's going to be airing soon for the SDC on YouTube. 97. So keep your eyes peeled for that one. I hope all 120 of you in the YouTube live stream are enjoying this as much as we are. Cracking game. And the perfect game for a final. 59. But it's not to be. It's a quarter final, I should remind you. 259. I think he's realistically here going to have nine darts. Will. Yeah. 99. 160. Can he clean up 160 and six darts? You would suggest he can. Yeah. Belmont, Could Belmont round us off with another 180 to make his 180. Eight, 180 of the game. That's the ninth 180 of the game. Absolutely ridiculous scoring. Can Belmont. we finish on 160, Marcel Wolfen? Oh, <laughs> he wanted it to go. 95 left, treble 19. We'll leave him a double. 84. Okay, Stephanie require 158. Stephen Belmont here, 158. Has Belmont got this in the locker? Of course he does. Well, it, his body language doesn't look great for this, James. I... These aren't the darts of a defeated man. Can he just 134. He 12, Marcel, you require 76. Will he have one or two, Marcel Wolfen here? It's just going to be one, and I think that one is going to be a double 18. Can he find it? 40. Oh, it's on the wire. Stephanie required okay, 24. This game has still got life in it now. The lips clench on the front row there. Marcel Wolpen's fiance can't watch. Oh, he's gone okay. quite away inside. Game short in the oh, seventh leg. Six. Stefan Belmont. Exact Eight same leg way that Stefan Marcel Wolpen took out 24 earlier in this game. 90, game on. Nine average for Stefan Belmont and a 94 average for Marcel Wolpen. Stefan Belmont needs to hold and break. Sounds simple, right? It does Let's sound see. simple. Can we get our 10th 180 of this game? Our 10th 180 of this game. 180. Oh, my. We've had 10 180s. It's absolutely incredible. Seven for Stefan Belmont. Seven 180s. James, you've lost count. I've lost count. I'm pretty sure. The treble 20 itself lost count. <laughs> oh, he's 44. hit. That's not even to mention, that, he's hit a, a, a 171 as well in there. That treble 20 segment needs replacing. Because these two gentlemen are peppering it, and that's four perfect that's darts. That's perfect for nine. That's oh, my perfect God. Perfect come darts. On. 180. Here we go. The only man to have achieved, well, six perfect darts is Marcel Walpen. Stephen, and Stephen one hundred and eighty. Stephen, you require oh one hundred and forty-one. Throw a nine darter. He's smiling. Is it going to go? Oh, oh my goodness! Oh, oh, I was looking at the nineteens. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was so exciting. We were two darts away from the history there. Oh, seven into the nine. Stefan knows what's left. He knows the 66 remaining. There has been 11 180s in this game. <laughs> There's been eight for Stefan Belmont. In There's been seven three in this leg. There's been three 180s in this leg. This is a quarter final of the first SDC tour event of the year. 93. Are you not entertained? That was incredible. Is Switzerland not the hottest property in darts right now? With yeah. these two representatives? It sure must be soon. These two are 500 to 1 to win the World Cup of Darts, folks. 500 to 1. <laughs> it's it's quality like this. It's worth a bit of 85. Stephanie require 48. Five second travel, which means Belmont has six, and this is looking like it's going to go to a last leg decider. It's a double 16, under no real pressure. Game short in the 8th leg, Stefan Belmont. Belmont in this leg. It's an 11 data. Ninth and final leg <laughs> is do? Marcel to throw We're first. We're going all the way, folks. Game on. We're going all the way. Stefan Belmont's averaging 103 and hasn't yet put this game to bed. So it's a last leg decider. 
They are both smiling, but don't get confused. They will both desperately want to win this game. 55. Here. Is that a last dart treble there? Did it sneak in? No, it didn't. Belmont here can punish him. Remember, Marcel Walpen, 4-1 uh, up in this game, looking to be on, in cruise control, really. Is he going to start 55 as well? 55. He does. Back-to-back -back 55. Eight legs and two visits, and we can't separate them. We agree, Finney. This is a very impressive World Cup outing. Peaking at the right time, you'd say, both of these players. 93. 93 scored from Marcel Walken. Crucial last dart treble there. Belmont will just be trying to get that first dart in the treble 20, but it's dragged it slightly low. Is he going to stay there or is he going to switch down to 19? 59. Six trebleless, trebleless darts from Stefan Belmont. We haven't said that much today. No. He's surely due a 180 at this point. Well, anyway. he's overdue a 180, yeah. Hitting more than one 180 per 81. leg in this game. Slightly stray there, Marcel Wolfen. So he does let Belmont in slightly. 140 and he's, he's back in front. There's one in again. Ooh, I was about to announce 180, James. 100. He has one dart in the treble. I honestly might think as well every announce time it. it's a 180. So, Marcel Wolfen, 272. Perfect first dart. Just needs to make sure. Sometimes when he rushes it, he can just pull it left and right. What chunk can he take out of it? Can you take out 120 points of it? 82. We can't, okay. 82 scored. Puts him on 190. 97 points in front of Stefan Belmont, minus these. But could Should this be another it? one? <laughs> oh, okay. 100. He's slight nerves yeah. because he's dropping them slightly below. This is what he does sometimes on the Euro Tour. Marcel Wolpen also going left and right. Is he going to go ball here, maybe, last start? 54. Goes 19, so leaves 136, which is not obviously the nicest finish. It's possibly the worst leg of the game, James, and that's no disrespect to these two men, because this has been a brilliant quality encounter. But we're just seeing the sign of nerves. We're just seeing the jitters here. Probably will want to go back upstairs to leave a two data. But what he's thinking is he can't really see it if he goes back upstairs. 48. He goes downstairs. Doesn't leave Marcel nice require finish. 136. Nice to shake off the nerves in the background there. He would just be thinking, ton, stay straight, one treble. Come back to three and under, his favourite double 18. 100. What he'll be doing if Stefan Stephanie Belmont require 139. Of brilliance. That ton there is better than any 180 that Stefan Belmont has thrown all game. In the context of the game, you're right, James. Marcel Wolfen will come back with three in hand for his first chance to beat Stefan Belmont in an SDC Tour game and advance to the semi-final. And it's nothing more than he deserves. 115. In this game, Marcel Wolfen. Marcel, you require 36. Deserves every strike he's going to get if he can check this double 18. One dot in hand now. Really getting nervy. 18. And he goes inside. Oh my, Stefan Belmont did not 24. think he was going to get three darts to win this game. So Stefan Belmont was on 60, James. He decided to go treble 12 to maybe avoid the bust. He's hit the treble 12. A little bit of showmanship there to leave double 12 and win the game. Game shot. Yes, it and is. a match for <laughs> Stefan Belmont. Marcel Wolf and a victory. But after 10 180.